Hey, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Nassine. I'm 37. I do keto vlogs, hauls, meal preps, reviews, all the things keto. I have four beautiful kids, a floofy, fluffy husky, two kitty kitties, and I love the clicky clickies. Give me a click, join the click fam, and leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you guys had for dinner, Let anything you want. If you guys are struggling, whatever you want. If you guys need support, my fam down there will help you out. I'll help you out. Let's we are a group, we are a family, we are a click. You guys are my clicky clickies. So let's support each other. Um, today I am, and if you are new here, what's up? This, this is what I do. I am in my car during the week for lunch. That's how I start my videos. And then you see me again after work and maybe something added in. Weekends are a little bit different. Um, I do do daily vlogs, but so I did make some keto chow the other night and I have that here, but I just, I'm not, I'm not craving keto chow lately. I kind of, like I, I just want salad. That's what I want. If I want a salad, then that's what I'm going to be doing. So, um, what I really wanted was something hot, but they don't have good soup options here. Like I, I can't trust what's in there. So I'm just going to shake this up. This is romaine lettuce, um, like four tomatoes, three slices of cucumber, one serving of shredded cheddar cheese, one hard boiled egg, a serving of ham, a serving of chicken, and uh, about two tablespoons of bacon bits and Caesar dressing. You can't really see it now because I shook it up. But that's what I got. Oh, that's funny, I got that, but I also, for some reason, grabbed a pack of ranch. I'm, I don't need the ranch, I'll save that for another time. But breakfast, um, Bones Coffee Company. I had two cups of the O Fudge with some unsweetened vanilla almond milk, two tablespoons of MCT oil, well, one each. And uh, I think I did a tablespoon of pure sweetener in each of them delicious and I actually topped it off with a little bit of more just plain black coffee later on because I've been so tired I don't know what it is I've just been exhausted going to bed earlier waking up later even I don't know I'm just so worn out I am worn out I am so ready for this Christmas vacation even though I have nothing planned I mentally physically need the break I look like a big balloon <laughs> Oh my gosh. Um, but yeah. So that's what's going on today. Uh, I only got 20 minutes left to lunch, so I need to hurry up and eat. So I'll see you guys after work. And I don't know what we're doing for dinner either. So we'll figure that out when we get to that road. All right, guys. See you soon. All right, guys. So I'm going to make a fat head dough. I've not made a fat head dough in a long time, it's been a while. So, I have two cups of shredded mozzarella cheese and two tablespoons of cream cheese. I'm gonna put this in the microwave for about a minute. I'm gonna take it out, I'm gonna stir it. If it needs to go in for another 30 seconds, I'll do that, I'll stir it. You wanna get it until it's all nice and it looks like some blob of dough. I'll show you. This is what it looks like after one minute. See, it's like, no, we need to cook it longer. Thanks, Sheila. Tomorrow we have to wear. Tomorrow is ugly sweater day at work. Is this ugly enough? Link, do you, Link is up here. You think this is ugly, Link? What do you think? Is it ugly? You like it? You like it, Bobby? He's trying to put it on. Oh my God, he loves it. Oh, Link loves it. Hey, don't bite it. All right, so this is more the consistency. I'm gonna just stir it together. Now see, like, I can, this is actually a goop. And we're gonna just like, cause it's hot right now, so I can't really use my hands, but I'm just gonna stir it up with this butter knife. Here 
here comes the hard part. So now you're gonna add in one egg and three fourths cups of almond flour. I am using my almond flour from Nutstop. I do have a discount code for you guys in the description. Gets you 10% off. I don't get anything from it, but it helps you guys out. They sell all kinds of stuff. Check them out. So before I put my egg in, I'm kind of like mix this up and get it. Get the almond flour incorporated into this mixture. All right, so I have my cookie sheet and one of these and I put my dough on top of it and then I put another one of these as you can see i put a little bit of oil on it but not right there and then i put it on top and i just rolled it out with like a rolling pin i'm gonna bake this for 10 minutes at 425 degrees all right so this is the one that i made without any egg uh this was it worked so much better i don't know why every fat head dough recipe i look up says egg i'm gonna do this one with no egg um, I don't know, maybe that'll be bad, but I'm going to do it without egg. Also, I put Italian seasoning and garlic seasoning in, so there's nice, um, flavor to the crust. Pop this bad boy in for 10 minutes as well, and the other one should be getting done here in a minute. Here is the first crust. It's a little misshapen. Looks good though. Looks, does look good. It's nice and it feels like pizza crust. So there it is. I'm gonna put my sauce and my cheeses and everything on top.
All right, so here is both pizzas. This one I accidentally left in a little bit too long. I was trying on my ugly Christmas sweater. So there you have it, folks. All right, guys, so I have my my plate of pizza. I just tried a piece that had uh, the egg in the crust and okay, it tastes like fat. I'm gonna try a piece that I made without the egg in the crust. Mm. Pretty good. I'm gonna enjoy this and I'll see you guys soon.